Hey guys, on today's video I'm going to teach you how to put your iPod Touch. So this is a blue one, doesn't really matter which color you guys have. It's going to be the exact same instructions. Anyways, let's just go back to factory settings. So let's go right into your settings. Under your settings, we will go down into general. Under general, scroll all the way down and you guys will see reset. Under reset, this is where it all happens. So all we have to do is just tap on erase all content in settings. And yes, this will erase everything from your iPod Touch. So you're deleting all documents, photos, videos, personal information, your iCloud will be deleted, everything from it. So what we can do is back up and erase, just in case you guys wanna keep a backup. If you don't, just go and erase right now. Erase iPod. It's gonna ask you for your iCloud ID password, and then we can just go ahead and restore it. So right now we're restoring back to factory settings. That means again, it's deleting everything. It's gonna go back and we are good to go. So if you guys wanted to raise everything, all your content, sell it and everything, then I suggest doing this a day before you actually sell it. If that's the reason why you're doing this, don't do it the same day, just in case something happens. Make sure you guys have at least 50% of your battery. That's because during the installation of the iOS, you don't want anything to happen. Even during the erasing process, we do not want this to just all of a sudden turn off because you ran out of battery. So make sure to keep that battery going because you guys don't want to do that. If you guys do run into any problems, yes, you guys can hook this up to your computer and use iTunes in order to do the same process. iTunes is a free program for both Mac and PC. So if you guys have Windows, yes, iTunes works there just fine. Once it's done, you're gonna see this, okay? This is the screen that we want. That means we have to set it up again. So if you press the home button, you have to choose English and so on. So don't do that right now, because that's actually the setup process. We do not want to set it up again. We just want it done. So whoever owns this next, if you guys are doing that, do it. I do suggest just setting up without an iCloud ID. You guys could do that. I have a tutorial about that anyways. Um, but if you guys just wanted to do that, just reset it back to factory settings. That's all you guys had to do to turn it off right now. That's all you guys have to do. Actually turn it off. Just hold on to your power button up here and to shut down your iPod touch, just hold on to it until you guys see this again. So I'm going to do that again. So we're going to hold on to your power button, which is on the top of your iPod touch to so shut it down. And this is the only way to shut it down. Well, force shut it down right now that we're on this screen. So right now we're gonna see this where it says slide to power off. So we're just gonna slide it and it's gonna power off a black screen. That's exactly what we want. Anyways, that's it for this video tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.